Star City is uh, Russia's cosmonaut training town, and it's been around since about 1960. It's hidden in the woods, and it literally was hidden for years. I mean, it was, it was not on the map. It was top secret. It was like Russia's Area 51. Since uh, the, the fall of communism, they've, they've opened up Star City. Um, local tourists can go in, and also now there's this program with the, the private space explorers, also sometimes called space tourists, who are paying $30 million or so to go to the International Space Station, first have to go to Star City for about eight months to do their training. You know, it's a town, so people actually live there. It's, um, so people go there to get trained, but there are also 8,000 residents. It's more YMCA than Starship Enterprise, so it's, it's a bit it's a bit run down. If, if you want to go up as part of this, the Russian space program, you have to go to Star City and train. So that's why uh, these private space explorers are going there. Richard Garriott is extremely well known in the computer game industry. And the reason that this is such a passion for him is because he's actually the son of an astronaut. So his father is Owen Garriott who went up to the Skylab in 1973 and, and later went up again to the, um, the Space Lab. And it's been his life ambition to do this. But as a child, he was, his, his dream was, was thwarted at a very early age when he was told that his vision was so bad that he would never be an astronaut. So he basically spent the rest of his life doing everything he could to get to this point and had to overcome a lot of obstacles to get here, including his bad vision, which he ended up getting eye surgery to correct. Um, he had to obviously raise the money, which he did through um, selling millions and millions and millions of computer games. And he, you know, he had to create an opportunity, which he did through Space Adventures, um, a, a company of which he's an, a co-owner. And now he's, he's finally fulfilling this dream at the age of 47. And, and this is why he has shipped himself off to Star City um, to spend eight months training there for this trip, which will take place on October 12th. In the future, whether it is that we need to leave this planet and colonize somewhere else, whether it's resources that we can get in space, um, or whether it's simply just you know tourism and, and another place to go and explore, you know, this is thought to be the first step. And while we can all sit back here and think, wow, these people are spending $30 million and what does that have to do with me? You know, the idea is that this is opening a door that, that the other people are gonna be able to go through in, in different ways in the future, so.